Do you often feel tired, catch colds easily, or experience unexplained aches? These could be early warning signs your body is running low on vitamin D, and you might not even know it. Vitamin D deficiency affects over 1 billion people worldwide, and it's often misdiagnosed as stress, aging, or just general fatigue. In this video, we'll break down 9 early symptoms of vitamin D deficiency and how you can fix it before it impacts your long-term health. Vitamin D isn't just important for bones, it's a powerful hormone that plays a vital role in immune defense, mood regulation, metabolism, and even heart health. But here's the issue, your body can't produce it without sunlight. And even if you're outside regularly, factors like sunscreen, pollution, skin tone, and time of day can block your body's ability to absorb it. Plus, most people don't get enough vitamin D from diet alone. Let's explore 9 early warning signs your body is running low on this essential nutrient, and what you can do about it naturally. Number 1. Constant fatigue, even after sleeping well. Do you wake up feeling tired, no matter how much sleep you get? Vitamin D helps your body produce energy at the cellular level by supporting the mitochondria. In a 2014 study, people with low vitamin D reported significantly more fatigue, despite getting a full night's rest. This kind of fatigue is persistent and doesn't improve with naps, caffeine, or extra sleep. To do. Get a vitamin D blood test, specifically a 25-hydroxy vitamin D test. Spend 15 to 20 minutes in direct sunlight each day without sunscreen if safe. Add vitamin D-rich foods like eggs, mushrooms, and fatty fish to your meals. Number 2. Frequent illness or infections. Vitamin D is essential for activating your immune system. If you're catching colds or infections often, your immune defenses might be weakened due to low D levels. Studies show that adequate vitamin D can reduce the risk of respiratory infections by up to 40%. If you're always fighting off something, your immune system might be underpowered because of this deficiency. What to do? Eat more immune-supportive foods like tuna, salmon, and sardines. Get daily sunlight or use a vitamin D3 supplement if you live in a low sunlight area. Strengthen immunity with good sleep, hydration, and stress reduction. Number 3. Muscle weakness or cramps. Are your muscles sore or cramping more than usual? Vitamin D plays a key role in muscle contraction and recovery. Without enough of it, your muscles may feel weak or heavy, especially in the legs and arms. In older adults, vitamin D deficiency is linked to an increased risk of falls and mobility issues. What to do? Combine vitamin D with magnesium, found in foods like nuts, seeds, and leafy greens. Stay active with light strength training and stretching. Make sure you're getting enough protein and anti-inflammatory nutrients. Number 4. Mood changes or depression. Feeling low, anxious, or emotionally flat? Vitamin D helps regulate serotonin, a chemical in your brain responsible for mood balance. Low levels of vitamin D are linked to depression, seasonal mood disorders, and increased anxiety. One large study found that individuals with low vitamin D were more than twice as likely to experience depression symptoms. What to do? Spend time in natural morning light to stimulate both serotonin and vitamin D. Eat tryptophan-rich foods like turkey, oats, and yogurt to support mood. Ask your doctor if you may benefit from a daily D3 supplement. Number 5. Bone pain or aching joints. Do you feel a dull, deep ache in your lower back, hips, or legs? Vitamin D is critical for calcium absorption and bone health. Without enough of it, bones can weaken and the risk of osteomalacia, soft bones, increases. If your joints hurt or you feel stiff when walking or standing for long periods, your bones could be lacking support. What to do? Include calcium-rich foods like chia seeds, tahini, and leafy greens in your diet. Use D3 together with vitamin K2 for optimal calcium transport. Practice low-impact exercises like walking, yoga, or pilates. Number 6. Slow wound healing. If cuts or scrapes are taking longer to heal than usual, it could be more than just poor circulation or age. Vitamin D is involved in regulating growth factors and inflammation during the healing process. Low levels can impair your body's ability to repair skin, tissue, and muscle, leading to prolonged recovery time after injuries or surgeries. In some studies, people with chronic wounds like diabetic foot ulcers had significantly lower vitamin D levels compared to those without healing issues. What to do? Ensure you're getting at least the recommended daily amount of vitamin D. Support healing with zinc-rich foods like pumpkin seeds and chickpeas. Reduce sugar and processed foods that increase inflammation and slow recovery. Number 7. Hair thinning or hair loss. Thinning hair, especially at the crown or temples, might not be just genetics or stress. Vitamin D plays a role in the growth cycle of hair follicles. When it's deficient, hair follicles may enter the resting phase too soon, leading to shedding and reduced regrowth. 
Vitamin D deficiency is also associated with autoimmune hair loss conditions, such as alopecia areata. What to do? Eat more vitamin D supportive foods like egg yolks, mushrooms, and salmon. Get tested for ferritin and thyroid levels as well, they also affect hair health. Reduce scalp inflammation by avoiding harsh hair products or chemical treatments. Number 8. Back pain and spine discomfort. If you're experiencing persistent pain in your lower back or spine, you might not think of vitamin D, but you should. Vitamin D helps keep vertebrae and surrounding cartilage strong. Without it, your bones can weaken and compress, leading to spinal pain and discomfort. Research has shown a clear correlation between low vitamin D levels and chronic lower back pain, particularly in women. What to do? Incorporate gentle stretching and low-impact exercise into your routine. Take regular breaks if you sit for long periods. Ensure a balanced intake of calcium, magnesium, and vitamin D for spinal support. Number 9. Increased risk of fractures. Finally, if you're over 40 and have suffered even one fracture from a minor fall, that's a red flag. Vitamin D deficiency leads to poor calcium absorption, making bones brittle and more likely to break. Even younger individuals with low B levels are at greater risk of fractures due to weakened bone density. Silent bone loss is often unnoticed until a fracture occurs. What to do? Get bone density scan if you've had multiple injuries or family history of osteoporosis. Strengthen bones with weight-bearing activities like walking or stair climbing. Combine vitamin D with vitamin K2 and magnesium for optimal bone support. How to restore healthy vitamin D levels. If you recognize any of these signs, it's time to take action. The good news is that vitamin D deficiency is highly reversible, often within weeks or months if you address the root causes. Here's how to naturally restore your vitamin D levels. Number 1. Sunlight, the most natural source. Your skin makes vitamin D when exposed to ultraviolet B, UVB, rays from sunlight. Aim for 10 to 30 minutes of midday sun exposure, depending on your skin tone, location, and the season. If you live in a colder climate or wear full coverage clothing, you may not be getting enough year-round. Tips. Expose arms and legs to direct sunlight. Avoid sunscreen for the first 10 to 15 minutes. Avoid sun exposure through glass, it blocks UVB rays. Number 2. Eat more D-rich foods. Food alone usually won't provide enough vitamin D, but it can still support your intake. Top food sources include fatty fish like salmon, sardines, and mackerel. Cod liver oil, a traditional but potent option. Fortified foods like plant-based milks, cereals, and orange juice. Egg yolks. Mushrooms exposed to UV light. Try including at least one of these daily. Number 3. Take the right supplement. If your levels are very low, sunlight and diet might not be enough. Supplements are often necessary, but choosing the right type matters. Tips. Choose vitamin D3, tolicalciferol, over D2. It's more effective. Take D3 with a fat-containing meal for better absorption. Dosages vary. General maintenance is 1,000 to 2,000 U daily, but severe deficiencies may need higher doses prescribed by your doctor. Always test your levels before starting high doses. Number 4. Pair it with key nutrients. Vitamin D doesn't work alone. It needs support from other nutrients to be effective. Important combinations include Magnesium helps activate vitamin D in the body. Vitamin K2 ensures calcium is deposited into bones and arteries. Zinc and boron support bone metabolism and immune health. A holistic approach to nutrition always works better than single nutrient fixes. Number 5. Test, don't guess. Symptoms alone aren't enough. Always confirm with a 25-hydroxy vitamin D blood test. Optimal blood levels should fall between 30 to 50 nanograms per milliliter. Below 20 is considered deficient. Once you know your level, you can build a personalized plan to restore it. Vitamin D deficiency is more common than most people think, and the symptoms are often ignored, brushed off, or misdiagnosed. But now you know the warning signs. Fatigue, frequent illness, bone pain, hair loss, poor mood, and more. Catching it early can prevent long-term health issues, improve your energy, and protect your bones and immune system for years to come. Your body is trying to tell you something. It's time to listen. If you found this helpful, consider subscribing for more science-backed health tips and natural remedies. And let us know in the comments, have you experienced any of these symptoms? Your story might help someone else. Stay informed, stay healthy, and take care of your body.